Hi everyone, welcome to Smart Class, now known as Smart Learners. Today we are going to discuss some of the computer networking questions which are frequently asked during the interview. This is part 2. I have also uploaded part 1 which I link it down in the description box. Please check that out if you want to get some more questions based on computer networks. So let's get started with today's video. Our first question, what do you mean by simplex mode? In simplex mode, the communication between the nodes are said to be unidirectional. That is, only one of the two nodes on a link can transmit the information and the other device only receives the information. What is half duplex? In half duplex mode, both the nodes can send and receive information, but not at the same time. That is, when one device is sending the information, the other device only receives it and vice versa. What is full duplex? In full duplex mode, both the nodes are allowed to transmit and receive simultaneously. Here, the capacity of the channel is divided between the two directions. Next question. Name the different layers of OSI model. Physical layer, data link layer, network layer, transport layer, session layer, presentation layer and application layer. What are the responsibilities or functionalities of physical layer? The physical layer is responsible for movement of bits from one node to the next node. It also takes care of synchronization of bits physical topology and transmission mode, etc. What is unicast? In a computer network, unicast is a transmission process of sending messages to single destination in the network which is identified by a unique address. What do you mean by a firewall? Firewall is a security system in the network. It basically monitors as well as controls the network traffic, both incoming and outgoing traffic. The process is carried out based on some security rules which are predetermined. What is switching? In computer network, there are many devices or nodes connected. The mechanism or process of forwarding the data from one port to another towards the destination is called switching. What is multiplexing? In multiplexing, multiple analog or digital signals are combined into single signal. This is achieved by sharing or dividing the medium. What is attenuation? Attenuation refers to reduction in the signal strength. It can be analog or digital. It usually occurs during the distance transmission. What are the different switching techniques? Circuit switching, message switching and packet switching. What are the different types of network architecture or different types of network? Peer-to-peer -peer architecture and client-server architecture. What are the different multiplexing techniques? FDM that is frequency division multiplexing, WDM that is wave division multiplexing, TDM time division multiplexing. What is broadcasting? Broadcasting is a technique in which the same data is transmitted to all possible destination in the network. Question: What is bitrate? Bitrate is number of bits transmitted per second. It measures data bits. What is baud rate? It refers to number of signals change that occur per second. It measures number of symbols transmitted per second. What is PCM? PCM is nothing but pulse code modulation. It is one of the techniques for conversion of analog signals to digital data. What is a modulator? Modulator is a device used for creating a stream of bits from analog signals. It involves in conversion of analog signals into digital data or digital signals. Next question. What are the processes of PCM encoder? The different process of PCM encoder includes sampling of the analog to signals, quantization of the sampled signals and encoding the quantized values as stream of bits. What is channelization? The available bandwidth of a link is shared in time, frequency or code in multiple access method. This is known as channelization. Frequency division multiple access, time division multiple access, code division multiple access. Next question, what are repeaters? Repeaters are electronic devices that receive signals and retransmit at higher power or higher level so that the signal can travel at long distances. What is broadcasting? In networking, broadcasting is a process of transmitting the data packet to every node present in the network. What are the different protocols present in network layer? IP, that is Internet Protocol, is used in network layer. 
IP in turn uses the following supporting protocols ARP address resolution protocol RARP reverse address resolution protocol ICMP internet control message protocol and IGMP which is internet group message protocol our next question what is CRC CRC is nothing but cyclic redundancy check it is an error detection code used in storage devices and digital networks to identify or detect the changes in the raw data what is beaconing it is a technique used in token passing networks to monitor the status of the token passing process to ensure the proper functioning of the process thank you so much for watching this video uh, please like this video share this with your friends and also any suggestion please comment in the comments bar given below the other videos of mine which talks about the similar topics are given in the description box do check that out thank you once again so please like comment and subscribe to my channel